24th of October 2012. I'm just updating uh, what is happening here with our uh, My Tidal Energy project on the East Coast at Lotton Point. Um, so far, it's taken over two months to get um, our investor, uh, Saudi Arabians, uh, set up. And so we're just waiting for a phone call now uh, to seal the deal with, uh, between us uh, and uh, the Saudis um, in Ukraine. Uh, and um, our accountant, I've uh, been on the phone this morning, uh, Chris Taylor, from Pricewaterhouse Coopers, uh, across the road from here, downtown on the waterfront in Auckland, New Zealand. Um, so far, uh, he's quite confident that um, we'll uh, get something going uh, and conference uh, meet on Skype and uh, the um, broker uh, for the uh, uh, investors uh, is quite happy uh, with that arrangement in Ukraine. So I'm expecting to fly there uh, this week or early next week uh, as soon as we get um, clearance uh, today, hopefully, or tomorrow from a broker uh, there. I'm quite happy and um, so Chris is quite happy today uh, to uh, be appointed at some stage when we get a, a deal signed up uh, or tentatively on the phone. Uh, for me to go there. Uh, he'll chip in uh, to make sure I, uh, I get there and we can meet again meet before I go over uh, conference I meet with um, Charles Hasrell that's our lawyer our barrister, a criminal barrister here across the road from Chris Taylor on the waterfront on Hobson Street uh, and uh, Albert Street uh, so um, we'll um, meet uh, by conference call uh, with our investors and the broker um, before I go. Uh, so um, we'll be uh, uh, acquiring the loan uh, to buy equipment for the project. Uh, that's um, the helicopters uh, on the uh, list. I'll be going to have a look at them. The um, Russian MI-26 33,000 kilogram helicopters, the heavy lip ones, there's three of them. Uh, one for spear and two, two to operate the fully um, licensed and um, come with a crew of ten each, each and um, uh, certified and refurbished that's right through so we'll, uh, we'll uh, have a look at those and also we want to purchase the um, Lotton Point Motel I've got the uh, purchase agreement here uh, with me, that's our own one between us and the owners uh, there they're quite happy with that, we're quite happy to make a deal with that, so this video is for you um, the owners, to see that we mean business, uh, of purchasing it, like I said, as well as the fast ferry, the 66 metre long fast ferry, with a broker in uh, Tahiti, oh actually he's from uh, uh, California, somewhere over there Florida, I think Florida uh, so he's waiting for our call uh, as soon as I get clear uh, we'll let him know we'll pick it up and get it cleared to get here bring it down through Taiwan to pick up the solid hydrogen equipment compressors, the uh, canisters to store the hydrogen in and also the fuel cells uh, so we'll pick all those up at the same time bring it back here down Auckland, uh, Auckland on the waterfront so we'll station that Fast ferry is 400 passengers, 46 cars, vehicles. And so we'll refurbish it and take out 300 passengers and put in uh, five star hotels, uh, restaurants, um, boardrooms for meetings for people to hire and to take out into the ocean to fishing trips or just for general uh, hire and to take our um, visitors, uh, investors. Um, accommodate them in five star um, uh, surroundings and take them down the east coast uh, onto the site 25 to 100k out from Lotton Point this motel so I'll just give you a broad outlook on um, why we're getting this funding and so uh, PricewaterhouseCoopers will um, administer the uh, uh, shares, the billion shares uh, to bring in uh, more funding 
uh, for the project. We're, we're expecting to take about a year to build, and all the um, um, engineers uh, the money for that uh, to plan it all up and to bring in the um, uh, steel concrete and build it on land and these big helicopters will lift everything out into the middle of the ocean uh, like how they're putting those uh, wind turbines in the middle of the ocean with the, um, with the helicopters and so we've got our own, own helicopters to do that and they will carry the canisters um, sling them underneath from the uh, platform site uh, onto the um, uh, substations for the power project with fuel cells and these canisters straight into the power lines so there's no uh, engines as such uh, it's just um, new technology uh, of uh, hydrogen fuel from the ocean right? sea, water, hydraulic turbines power into electricity uh, in, into um, splitting the seawater into oxygen and hydrogen then compressing it into liquid hydrogen and then compress it again into solid metal and so we'll manage to pack more into that and that you won't lose any of it when you store it so that's the, the whole point of the exercise is to storage main key key uh, component in this uh, project uh, and uh, storage and lightweight cuts out the lit logistics of going by land we just fly everything straight onto site and onto uh, airports we'll um, have for aircraft uh, as well and we can just fly straight in and um, deliver all over the country so that's us and Ukraine will set up our operations there when I go up I'll put a, a new company there uh, and set up with those people to handle their own membership in their own country and so forth I'll go to Africa and India and set up those countries and London uh, so you have just New Zealand uh, New Zealand, London uh, or Britain uh, and um, Ukraine uh, and um, uh, the Pacific, we're, we're taking hold of the whole Pacific, there should be 60 of these platform bridges going in the middle of the ocean so um, that's how it's going to grow, it's going to start small and then grow from there, the idea will go right through the world and so, yes, so that's why I wanted to I'll let you know that I've had a long talk with Chris Taylor this morning. And I've had a long talk with um, uh, the broker up in uh, Ukraine. That's uh, since uh, the 21st of September. Right till now, it's taken this long uh, just to get uh, to that stage. And they are quite happy with the concept plan. And they'll be more than happier to deal with... Uh, Chris Taylor, uh, um, because he knows how this all works. I've, I've met him in 2008, and we went right over this project, and so he's familiar with uh, carbon credits and with the running this sort of energy project, uh, having been in it for quite some time with PricewaterhouseCoopers and Merrill Lynch and the banking systems. So uh, we're going straight into that on a very large scale, and so this is what this is designed for. Uh, with a high turnover and a big return on investment for investors, so for company investors. So when companies come in as investors, they, they stay in for life, and so they'll have a big shareholding in it, but the small uh, shareholders are all equally have, um, have that opportunity to share in the, um, in the big um, uh, shareholding. Uh, returns. So we're expecting 6% to start off with uh, anything from there up to 300% return on investment from these projects. Uh, so just let you know that today uh, that is, uh, that's how far we've gone to. We, we thank all the people who are waiting patiently for a long time, um, but I couldn't run this thing on my own. I bring in the experts to do that now, and so we can concentrate uh, more on building uh, this um, big project uh, in the middle of the ocean and so uh, yeah so that's all for now I just want to let you see this nice beautiful day today that we're having here in uh, New Zealand it's about 15 degrees uh, centigrade and not a cloud in the sky no chemtrails and uh, beautiful crisp clean air uh, no pollution no, uh, no sign of um, uh, anything like that uh, that's happening around the west of the world um, so we want to keep it clean and we want to keep our environment clean with this new product uh, solid hydrogen jet fuel 
so that um, we can share that uh, and um, um, all the profits that come from it go back to the shareholders uh, in a different way. We want to have our own water currency money and get away from the normal systems uh, through this project. Um, and once it goes, it'll, it'll go forever. So have a look at this day. It's very beautiful outside and I want you to really take note of, of what we are living in today here in the There we go. So here we have, here we have the blue skies. See, right there, around there. So that's the sky tower up there. Uh, right there. Yeah, about there. There. Um, yeah, so the sky tower. And um, around to the left here, we've got this um, new building that's gone up. And beautiful um, from Dominion Constructors. And there's the office there. there. We're going into the office there. See, so, so you see there. And, and then the restaurant over there, I, I see the people always eating, and I get hungry. I was about to go down and dinner with them. And lunch. So it's lunch time now, it's about, I'm around about 12 o'clock now. 12.05 p.m. So yeah, so that's, that's, uh, that's us, Auckland Museum. That's what it looks like today. Very happy with the weather. And uh, we're now progress so far. So thank you very much, and um, we'll see you very soon into the future. Bye for now and take care of each other, won't you?